This tutorial explains how to set up and use the AutoShot feature on your Garmin Approach S20. With AutoShot Round Analyzer, you can collect data to review, map, and analyze all your shots from each round you play. So let's start improving your game. To take advantage of all the cool features provided by AutoShot on your watch, you need to get connected to Garmin Connect. If you haven't already, download the Garmin Connect app to your Bluetooth-compatible smartphone or mobile device. Follow the steps within the app to wirelessly pair your devices. You can also watch our other tutorial video in this series, Pairing Your Phone. Once your devices are paired, you can use your Garmin watch with AutoShot to upload data automatically to your Garmin Connect online account. What types of data will you get? Well, that's the fun part. During a round, you can use the Measure Shot function to see how far you hit a particular shot like that drive you crushed on number 12. You can also check distances for each shot during your round. Syncing your device with Garmin Connect also allows you to view the auto shot map. The map shows the distance and location for each shot after it has been automatically uploaded for post-round analysis. You can compare your stats from previous rounds and analyze your tendencies. For example, are you missing to the left or right and by how much? Was it a hook? or a draw. Before you start your round, you will also be prompted to choose if you want scoring mode to be turned on. Select yes if you want AutoShot to save and upload your round. If you choose no, you can still use the measure shot feature to see the distance you're getting on each shot. However, the information won't be saved to Garmin Connect. Another choice you need to make before teeing off is whether or not to turn on club tracking. The first time you turn on club tracking, your golf watch will ask you to enter your typical drive distance. This information is used to predict what club you're likely to use for each shot. All you do is confirm the correct club. With club tracking turned on, after each shot, your Garmin device will ask you to identify the club you just used. The Garmin Connect app uses this information to calculate your distance for each club. You can identify the club you hit any time before you hit your next shot. If you forgot to enter a club for a shot, don't worry. Club tracking marks the club for that shot as unknown. You can correct the entry later when you're reviewing the data on Garmin Connect. When it comes to improving and fine-tuning your golf game, there's a lot you can do with AutoShot technology in the Garmin Approach S20 or other capable watches. You can learn more by watching other tutorial videos in this series.